Find the size, nature and position of the image formed when an object of size 1 cm. I mean this is the height of the object. So which we put as H, H1. So we just write that out. So H1 is object size which is 1 cm is placed at a distance of 15 centimeters. So this is the object distance. So u is object distance. And remember object distance is always taken negative in any case. So we put minus 15 centimeter. From a concave mirror of focal length 10 centimeters. So f is a focal length. And in this case, they said the focal length is 10 centimeter, but I am putting a negative sign to it because focal length for concave is always negative. For concave mirror is negative. So we'll first start, we'll now use the mirror formula. And the mirror formula goes as 1 over V plus 1 over U equal to 1 over F. The V we do not know, the image distance. 1 over U is the object distance, so that is minus 15. Remember, object distance is always negative. And the F is minus 10. So 1 by V equal to minus 1 by 10 plus 1 by 15. So 1 by V equal to 10 and 15, you take the LCM and the LCM of 10 and 15 is 30. So you'll get minus 3 plus 2. So 1 by V equal to minus 1 over 30. So V equal to minus 30 centimeter. So 30 centimeters is easy to understand, but why has a V come negative? What does it imply? So in this we got a u object distance minus 15. We said the v was minus 30 centimeter. So what does this negative sign of v imply? If you remember here we have the Cartesian plane and we always imagine the mirror to be on the y-axis. So here is our mirror on the y-axis. If u is minus 15 means the object is in the negative. And that's where we always keep the object, in the negative here. This is the object at minus 15. And if V is also minus 30, means the image is also in the negative. Somewhere at the side. This will be your image in the negative because it is minus 30. Now images formed on the left side here, this is the left and the right. Images formed on the left side are always real. And these are virtual for mirrors. The next step we need to find is magnification. So magnification, we know the formula is minus V by U. So minus, we know the V is minus 30 and the u is minus 15 so here the magnification becomes plus 30 over minus 15 the magnification is minus 2 now this negative sign minus indicates that the image is inverted and if it is inverted it must be real and this 2 indicates that the image is magnified is two times larger than the object image is magnified so what is the nature of the image if I were to ask you what is nature of image number one you will say it is real it is inverted it is magnified 
and it's on the same side as the object because it is also negative same side as the object that means it's in front of the mirror the object is always kept in front of the mirror at a distance 30 centimeters this will be the nature of the image we'll discuss magnification in real and virtual images now we know real images are inverted that means if the object is upright here h1 will be positive but since the image is inverted the image height h2 will always be negative and magnification you know is image over object which is negative over positive so magnification in real will always be negative so if you get magnification negative it is real inverted image so let me write that magnification negative what will you imply it is a real inverted image now when we come to virtual images they always form behind the mirror the rays actually do not meet they cannot be captured on the screen and for virtual images they are erect images which means the object is always erect h1 is taken positive but the image is also erect in virtual so the h2 which is the image height is also positive so magnification you know is h2 image over object so magnification will be positive over positive so magnification will be positive so if magnification is positive means what the image is erect and virtual keep this in mind as we do the sums let me repeat again for real image magnification negative for virtual image magnification positive so in the previous sum again we knew, we knew magnification was minus 2 height of the object was given as plus 1 centimeter the formula magnification height of uh, image over height of object so minus 2 height of image we needed to find height of object was plus 1 so minus 2 into 1 that is h2 so height of image was minus 2 centimeter so and why did we get this negative sign because the image is inverted inverted image that is why is a negative sign so you write height of image equal to 2 centimeter don't write minus 2 centimeters inverted an object 2 centimeter high so object height is 2 centimeters that means h1 which is uh, object height equal to 2 centimeters plus 2 centimeters object is always taken as erect is placed at a distance 16 centimeters from concave mirror so 16 centimeters is u the object distance so object distance is 16 but we always have to take negative remember object distance is always to be taken negative in any case it produces a real image 3 centimeters high so 3 centimeters must be the height of the image image height equal to 3 centimeters but they said the image is real and that is important it is a real image if it is a real image it must be inverted and if it is inverted we will put minus 3 centimeter so the height is minus 3 centimeter in this case we are going to start with the formula magnification is height of image over height of object and uh, in this case we know 
m we do not know height of uh, h2 is minus 3 h1 is plus 2 so the magnification is minus 3 by 2 this is the first part next uh, we can we also know that uh, magnification equal to minus v by u the magnification is minus 3 by 2 v we do not know the image distance we do not know but the object distance is given as minus 16 now we solve this so we get minus 3 by 2 the minus minus cancels out into 16 equal to v and the v now turns to be minus 24 centimeter so now that we know v and we know u we can find f we know v and this is the u now we'll go ahead and find f to find f we do the mirror formula and the mirror formula is 1 by v plus 1 by u equal to 1 by f so 1 by v we know is minus 24 u was 16 minus 16 equal to 1 by 1 by f uh, the LCM here is 48 so this becomes minus 2 and here minus 3 equal to 1 by f so minus 5 by 48 equal to 1 by f and f equal to minus 48 by 5 and the f is minus 9.6 centimeter so focal length of mirror equal to minus 9.6 now why did we get negative because negative because it is a concave mirror remember in concave mirror the focal length is always negative so 9.6 centimeter is a focal length a concave mirror produces three times magnified a real image three times magnified magnification equal to three now you magnification is always got a sign now here they said it is a real image they've given here real image so if it is real we know real images are inverted and hence the magnification will be minus 3 now for the next part of an, of an object placed at 10 centimeters so this is object distance u equal to object distance minus 10 object distance always taken negative in front of it where is the image located so we have magnification formula minus v by u we put our values we saw the magnification is minus 3 minus v we don't know v u is minus 10 so this will cancel out so we have v equal to minus 3 into 10 minus 30 centimeter equal to v now since v has come negative which means negative means object and image are on the same side because object is always taken negative or object distance and image distance is also negative therefore means the image is on the same side as object and since the object is in front of the mirror we can say image is in front of the mirror if I were to draw the figure here would be a mirror the object would be somewhere here in the negative we always take this part negative and this is positive and the image also would be somewhere here only on the same side because the V also has turned minus 30 centimeter the object distance was of course minus 10 centimeters 
both are negative so both are on the left hand side of the mirror all the negatives come on the left hand side of the mirror what is the position of the image when an object is placed at a distance of 20 centimeters this is object distance so u from a concave mirror of focal length 20 so focal length f you can do this orally but let's work the sum out so our object distance which we take as u is 20 centimeter and you know object distance is always taken as negative so this is negative always the next is the focal length focal length which we write as f in this case is also 20 centimeters and uh, this is a concave mirror and in concave mirror negative so we have to write here focal length in concave is negative now for the mirror formula we have 1 over v plus 1 over u equal to 1 over f so 1 over v we don't know 1 over u minus 20 f also minus 20 and interesting if you see 1 over v will be minus 1 over 20 plus 1 over 20 it cuts out and 1 over v equal to 0 that means v equal to uh, not ex you won't see zero yeah so v you can see is infinity is zero over one so zero one doesn't exist but uh, uh, equal to v is infinity so where is the image form image is formed very far away image formed at infinity and if you carefully read this if you see this case if here is your concave mirror and uh, the f focal length here is minus 20 and the object is kept at the focal length here is the object kept at the focus and when the object is kept at the focus we know image is at infinity you can check up your diagrams and see when the object is kept at focus the image is at infinity an object 10 centimeters of height so this is the height of the object so we are going to put height of the object 10 centimeter is placed at a distance 36 from a concave mirror so 36 must be object distance an object distance is always negative 36 centimeter that is u from a concave mirror of focal length 12 so focal length is 12 however we put minus 12 because concave mirror remember for concave mirror f is always negative find the position nature and height of the image so first we are going to find out the image height so for this we uh, I mean image distance so we'll use the mirror formula and the mirror formula goes as 1 by v plus 1 by u equal to 1 by f on substituting we have 1 by v we don't know the v u we take as minus 36 equal to f minus 12 so 1 by v equal to minus 1 by 12 plus 1 by 36 so 1 by v LCM will be 36 so this is minus 3 plus 1 which is minus 2 by 36 it will cancel out and 1 by v will be minus 1 by 18 and the v will be minus 18 centimeters so we got v and now we also know u so if we got v and u we can go ahead and find magnification so magnification is minus v by u minus we saw v is minus 18 so minus 18 
and u is minus 36. So magnification is, if you cancel this, becomes minus 1 by 2. Now, if it has got a negative sign, if magnification is negative, this indicates the image is inverted. And if it is inverted, it must be a real image. And it is 1 by 2. 1 by 2 means the image is diminished. 1 by 2 is less than 1. So the nature of the image is inverted, real and diminished. So we got on with magnification minus 1 by 2. Uh, because it was negative, we had two points that we could write is image is inverted and it is a real and then we have 1 by 2 so with 1 by 2 the conclusion we could derive it is diminished and we know the v was minus 18 that means if it is minus 8 minus, the v was minus, means the object and image are on the same side. So image is on the same side as object. Same side as object with a centimeter means in front of the mirror. Object is always kept in front of mirror and the image is also in front of the mirror. Now to find the size of the image, for that we know magnification is height of the image over height of the object. The magnification is one, minus 1 by 2. Height of image we do not know but the height of object was given to us as 10 centimeter. So the H2 will be minus 10 over 2 and the h2 became minus 5 centimeter. Now why did we get this negative sign? Why did the height come negative? Because it is a inverted image. It, everything matches here. So it is an inverted image and I, you know inverted images are a real. That we have already seen earlier. But h2 again comes 5 centimeters. So you see height of the object is the height of image we are finding here is 5 centimeters. Don't write minus 5, 5 centimeters inverted. Describe the nature of the image when an object is placed 20 centimeters from the concave mirror of focal length 10. So here we see that the object distance is 20 centimeters. And it has to be negative because object distance always taken negative. And focal length is 10 centimeter. Look back and see what kind of mirror is this. This is a concave mirror. And because it is concave mirror, this will be always negative. So we go on to the mirror formula. And we'll find the image distance. So 1 by V plus 1 by U equal to 1 by F. And uh, 1 by V, we don't know the V. The U is minus 20. F is minus 10. So 1 by V equal to minus 1 by 10 plus 1 by 20. So 1 by V is 20 minus 2 plus 1. 1 by V is minus 1 by 20. So V is minus 20 centimeters. That is the image distance is minus 20 centimeters. Now to find the nature is best to find the magnification. So we know the formula for magnification is minus V by U. So we have minus of minus 20 because V is minus 20 and the U we know is minus 10. No, U is minus 22, yeah. So minus 20. So if you see the magnification becomes minus 1. So what does that imply? We said magnification is minus 1. The negative sign 
here this negative sign minus means it is inverted and because inverted it is real and this one sign means it is same size same size as object so to go over it again we got a magnification minus 1 the negative sign in indicated it was a real and inverted then the one sign this one said it was of the same size same size as object and if you remember the V came minus 20 so the V was negative which means the image at the object both are the, both on the same side because the u was also minus 10 centimeter so image is on the same side as object or you can say image is in front of the mirror So these are the nature and position of the image. Before we get on to the sum, I want to explain one point. Here is a mirror. Real images will be formed on the left hand side and virtual images will be formed on the right hand side. Why so? Because when the rays come in here in this manner, if they have to actually meet, they will meet on the side, on the left hand side. But if they appear to meet, they will be on the right hand side. So when it comes to image distance, if it is a real image, it is formed on the left hand side and the V will be negative but if it is virtual image it is formed on the right hand side behind the mirror and it will be positive the V will be positive so you need to remember this let's summarize it for this is only for mirrors real image is formed on the left hand side and the V is negative. Virtual image formed on the right hand side and the V is positive. Let's get back to the sum. And now this sum says at what distance from a concave mirror of focal length 10 centimeters. So here focal length 10 I am putting negative because it is concave. In concave, F is always negative. Should an object be placed? Our question is we have to find the object distance. So that a real image is formed at 20 centimeters from the mirror. So the V is 20 centimeters. The image is at 20 centimeters. But remember, the image is real. And if the image is real, we have to put minus 20, like in this case. If image is real, the V is negative. Now for the mirror formula, we have 1 by V plus 1 by U is 1 by F. 1 by V means 1 by minus 20. Here image distance is given. The object distance we need to find. F is minus 1 by 10. So 1 by u equal to minus 1 by 10 plus 1 by 20 and 1 by u LCM will be 20 minus 2 plus 1 minus 1 by 20 so u is minus 20 centimeter. So the object has to be kept 20 centimeters in front of the mirror. So object has to be kept 
20 centimeter in front of the mirror. If the magnification of a body of size 1 meter, so object height or object size, which we always write as H1, is 1 meter. Magnification is 2. So magnification equal to 2. What is the size of the image? Now size of image is our question uh, and the formula we know magnification is height of image over height of object. So magnification 2, height of uh, image we do not know, height of uh, object is given as 1. So height of image is 2 meter. So we can say here height the answer, height of image equal to 2 meter. It's an erect image because the height has come positive. At what distance from a concave mirror? So we have to find the object distance of focal length 10 centimeters. So 10 centimeter will be negative because it is concave mirror. Here again the height of the object is given as 2 centimeters so I'll put plus 2 centimeters. It's placed in order to get an erect image 6 centimeter tall. So 6 centimeter we put positive because it is an erect image. So in this sum I first start with magnification. Magnification is height of image over height of object. So magnification is 6 over 2, magnification is 3. So this is 1. In the next step, I know magnification is minus V by U. So magnification is 3 minus V by U. I do not know V, I do not know U. So I can say 3u equal to minus v, v equal to minus 3u. This is the second result. Now I go for the mirror formula. The mirror formula is 1 by v plus 1 by u equal to 1 by f. So for v I am going to put minus 3u. I get it from here. v is minus 3u plus 1 by u equal to 1 by f. f is minus 10. I'll go ahead and solve this. So it is 3u. So you have minus 1 plus 3 equal to minus 1 by 10. When you solve further, we'll get 2 over 3u minus 1 by 10. On cross multiplying, 2 into minus 10 equal to 3u. So u equal to minus 20 by 3. So u is minus 6.66 centimeters. So we can say u is minus 6.7 centimeter. The question was where was the email or object to be kept? So object should be kept 6.7 centimeters in front of the mirror. And why front is because we've got this negative, this is minus because the u came as negative and u always is negative or images object should be always kept in front of the mirror. When an object is placed at a distance 15 centimeters, so object distance is 15 centimeter, 
and it is negative always. From a concave mirror, its image is formed as 10 centimeters in front of the mirror. So 10 centimeters is image distance and it is in front of the mirror, just like the object. So that also will be negative. Calculate the focal length of the mirror. So mirror formula. one by f equal to one by v plus one by u so one by f v is minus 10 centimeters minus 15 centimeter lcm 30 minus 3 minus 2 one by f minus 5 over 30 so 1 by f minus 1 by 6. So f is minus 6, 6 centimeter. Why did we get a negative sign? Because it, it is a concave mirror. Remember for concave mirror, the focal length is always negative. So the answer, concave mirror has focal length six centimeter. Don't write negative. You just had write the focal length is 6 cm. An object 3 cm high, so it is the height of the object plus 3 cm, is placed at a distance 8 cm from a concave mirror. So object distance is 8 cm. So here we write uh, 8. An object distance is always taken negative, so we put the minus sign produces a virtual image 4.5 cm high. So 4.5 will be the height of the image, 4.5. And now it is virtual. Virtual means it is erect. So if it is erect, it will be plus 4.5. We need to find the focal length, the position of the image. So since we know H1 and H2, we will start with the formula magnification equal to h2 object over image so we have now magnification we know h2 is 4.5 and the height of the object is 3 so magnification is 45 over 30 i remove the decimal magnification is 3 over 2 now we also know that magnification is equal to minus v by u so which means 3 by 2 which we have found earlier here magnification 3 by 2 equal to minus v we do not know v but we know u u is given here minus 8 so minus 8 so now v equal to this minus minus will cancel 3 by 2 into 8 and v will be equal to 12 centimeters now remember V is positive, the U was minus 8 and V is positive 12, which means if V is positive, the object, the image is formed behind the mirror. So we write that image is formed behind the mirror. It's on the opposite side of the object. Our next step is to find focal length. So we know the u and we know v. If we know u and v, we can find the focal length. So v which is the image distance equal to 12 cm and the object distance u equal to minus 8 cm. The mirror formula one by f equal to one by v plus one by u so one by f one by v v is 12 u is minus 8 so one by f equal to 12 and 8 lcm 24 so this is 2 minus 3 so one by f minus one by 24 so the f is plus 20 uh, minus 24 centimeters so for the answer 
we can see it is a concave mirror. How do we know it is concave? Because the focal length has come negative. Concave mirror with focal length 24. This negative sign here, this negative indicates it is concave. Concave mirror has got negative focal length. A converging mirror, when they say converging mirror, it must be they are talking about concave mirror because a concave mirror is a converging mirror, forms a real image of height 4 centimeters. So 4 centimeters is the height of image. which we write as H2 and this is 4 centimeters. Now it is real. So if it is real, the image it must be inverted. It means it will be minus 4 centimeters of an object of height 1 centimeter. So 1 centimeter is object height. Height of object that is h1 plus 1 centimeter place 20 centimeters away from the mirror so the object distance which is uh, u minus 20 centimeters calculate the image distance in the focal length now whenever we know h2 and h1 we know both of them so we can find magnification. Magnification is height of image over height of object. So magnification is minus 4 over 1. So magnification minus 4. The next formula for magnification is minus V by U. We know the magnification is minus 4. We already found that out. Equal to minus v. Now v we do not know. Object dis uh, image distance we do not know. But object distance is minus 20. So v equal to this will cancel out. So 4 into 20. So v equal to minus 80 centimeter. So remember this is minus. The image distance is minus. Which means it is formed on the same side as the object. Image is formed on same side as object now that we know v and we know u we can go ahead and find the f by using mirror formula the fo mirror formula is 1 by f equal to 1 by v plus 1 by u. So the v, we know our v is minus 80, u is minus 20. So 1 by f will be equal to LCM 80 minus 1 plus 4, minus 4. This will be minus 5 by 80 and you get your F as minus 16 centimeter. The negative sign here indicates F is come negative. So it, this indicates it is a concave mirror. So for the answer here, calculate the image distance. Image distance is 80 centimeters behind mirror because it had come negative. An object of size 7 centimeters so object height which is h1 equal to 7 centimeter is placed at 27 centimeter in front of the concave. So this is object distance. Which we write as u and that is 27 centimeter always negative. 
in front of a concave mirror of focal length 18. So, focal length which we denote as F is 18 centimeter and this is a concave mirror and uh, because it is concave we have to put negative. Now, at what distance should a screen be placed? Screen is where the image is formed. Image here is formed on screen. It is a screen that captures the other image. That means we have to find now image distance is our question. So that the sharp focus image can be obtained. Now we know a U and we know F, so we start with mirror formula. Wait, 1 over F equal to 1 over V plus 1 over U. So 1 over minus 18, V we need to find, U is minus 27 minus 1 by 18 plus 1 by 27 equal to 1 by V. So 1 by V equal to LCM here will be 54 of 18 and 27. This will be minus 3 plus 2. 1 by V equal to minus 1 over 54. So V equal to minus 54 centimeters. Now remember that V has come negative, means it is on the same side as the object. So the screen or the image here, the screen is kept where the image is formed. So the screen is kept 50 centimeters from the mirror on the same side of the object. or you could say in front of the mirror. Now next we need to find what is the size and nature. For this we will find magnification. So to find nature, we are going to find magnification. Which is M. And we know magnification is minus V by U. So M equal to minus. Uh, let's just write down the value of V. We got the value of V as minus 54 centimeter. And U was given as minus 27 centimeter. So minus of minus 54 and u was minus 27. So magnification is minus 2. The negative sign, this negative sign, it indicates the image is inverted. Therefore it is real. And this 2 indicates that the image is magnified. It is two times as larger than the object. So when I want to write the nature, I get three points. I'll say it is real, inverted, and magnified. And uh, I, uh, the position where it is formed, we saw that V was coming as minus 54. That means it is formed in front of the mirror, in the same side of the object. Because U also is negative, V also is negative, is both are formed on the same side. 